Hey everybody, I'm Zach. This is Schmirkadabur, and welcome back to Subnautica. Uh, we are uh, making the enzymes, which will allow us to hatch our friends down in the depths. We have enzymes. A still suit reclaims moisture from the body and provides clean, drinkable water. Eh, meh. I would rather prevent damage. Okay. Now we just have to go back to uh, to the downstairs and we're good. So let's take a quick trip to, uh, we've got plenty of water and I think there's water in the, um, in the Seamoth as well, right? Yes, there is. Let's go to the gates of hell so we can hatch up an egg. Now, if we have to make a whole bunch of them, um, it's not that big of a deal. We can make a whole bunch of them. We have the capabilities. All right. Man, I, I'm, I'm shocked. Shocked, I say, that OBS is so, um, is so laggy. And it's really, it's only with this game. Now, OBS doesn't believe that it has dropped frames, but I believe that it has dropped frames. It sucks. It's a real bummer, I tell you what. Okay. Gate to hell. Um, it actually seems like it might not be, like, totally hellish, actually. Believe it or not. Um... Because there's, like, a really nice guy down there. He's super friendo. Um, he's a nice guy, this uh, Sea Emperor Leviathan. Or a nice lady. He's got a bit of a lady voice, and that's okay, too. Um, either way, gate to hell. We're almost there. Almost ready to get our egg hatching on we're gonna have babies everybody we're gonna have our own children to nurture and care for okay so excuse me sorry excuse me all right and in we go so we have the hatching enzymes again hopefully we only need one of them um to hatch all the eggs because i if they just make you make six then that's lame that's real lame all right. Yeah, that would be a bummer. Um, although I'm growing everything that I need to make them. So, like, it wouldn't take too long to, to get six of them. It would just be, like, tedious, you know? Uh, all right. Take me. Take me to the bottom. 1,430 meters depth. Dude, I am so stoked that we don't ever have to drive the submarine out of there. I don't think that there's anywhere else that we need to go um, that would require us to have the, uh, yeah. the, the Cyclops. Now, on top of that, um, dude, I'll bet I can walk the prawn suit out of here, too. I can probably take the prawn suit through a portal. So we just leave the Cyclops down here, which again, I would be totally fine with. Okay. Zoom. Hello, I'm back. I'm back and I brought treats. I brought treats for your little babbies. Oh, this is exciting, everybody. This is real exciting. Okay. Bam. Okay, there is indeed only five eggs as well. But check it. Insert hatching enzymes. Here they come. Here's little bab- <gasps> It's hatching already. Oh, little babbies. Look at how cute they are. Oh. Oh, I love them and they are adorable. Look. Your children's, your little chitlins are out and ready to go. Are you happy? Are you a happy baby? Hello? Oh, can I scan them as well, maybe? Whoa, whoa. 
Whoa. <laughs> I'm not on the scanner. There we go. Sea Emperor Juvenile. Yes. Scanned. I did it. I did it, man. Give me a hug. Give me a little hug. Oh, that's so nice. Um, so... What now? They've been scanned. I'm still infected. What's happening here? I scanned your babbies. I... I did it. What am I supposed to do now? Anybody? <laughs> Come on. What's going on here? Okay. S oh, I hear them squeaking. Now, I don't need to go all the way back up. There's brain coral like everywhere. I can just go stand on top of this brain coral. That's what I should do. Okay. Give me that sweet, sweet oxygen juice. All right. All right, I'm getting air back. The thing is, is like these guys aren't doing anything with me. <gasps> Look at this. Look at this. My young oh, swimming oh. The shallows. Yes. I thank you. You're welcome. Their freedom is my end. Oh, that's nice. Like I wonder, to go to sleep and never wake up. Uh, it'll be cool and chill, I'm sure. I will be an ocean current carrying seas to a new land. Maybe. A creature so small, it sees the gaps between the grains of sand. Wow. Farewell. So you got you got a real like kind of Buddhist mentality, um, Sea Emperor, and I appreciate that. I appreciate that greatly. Can I scan these hatched eggs? No. I can. How did I never scan the incubator? Hatching enzymes. <laughs> okay. Now, we're not going to go back out through the... Um... Oh, but check it. Am I cured? I'm still infected. Maybe I should go through... Here. I can always swim back. I can always come back through here after I go through here, too. Let's do that. All right. Um, I can just, like, go out there and meet the babbies. And then come back. And then go back out through the way I came in so I can get my, uh, my Seamoth back. So we can hop in Schmur's Folly. And, yeah, these guys should, um... They should cure my infection. They should be good. They should be able to make my infection not present anymore. Um, and once I have that... Hello, little babbies. Oh! Uh, what? Is, what? Concentrated enzyme 42, huh? Blurp. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's goopy. Oh, it's just... I can't get it off. Oh, it's gonna kill. It's murdering me. It's murdering me. And it's going through my. Oh my god, it's all up ends. Okay. So now, check it. Vital signs normal. Vital signs normal. No remaining sign of bacterial infection. Thank you, little babbies. Thank you so much. Um, wow. That's so good. And this is... This is where I need to be, actually. Dude, let's do it. Um, this is the... Uh, the mountain island. So I can just come here pop up and I can I can end the quarantine. This is incredible. So much is happening. Take me up. 
Woo! Yeah! Did I want to go all the way to the tippy top, though? Did I want that to happen? Because, uh... I don't think that this is the place that has what I need. I think I actually need to go back downstairs. I never, never, ever figured out the layout of this place. Woo! Dude, it's a fun ride, though. It's a fun ride. I like how the elevator itself, like, corrects you <laughs> as you're, like, terrified, zooming towards the ground. Um... It's nice. It's nice that it does that for you. Okay. Yes, there's a room in here somewhere. Is it this? No. This is a gate. Okay. What gate takes you there? That's bizarre. Um, is that where I came out of? Is this the... Yes. All right. So that's this floor. Let's go up. We gotta... <laughs> we gotta find our way here. There's no doors here, so let's continue going up. And there's no doors here, so upwards it is. There's a doomsday device. But nothing else on this floor. Um, there's nothing that way, so it has to be over here. This is it. I believe. I actually think this is it. Yes. Okay. Oh, man. Something real is about to happen here. Stab me. Ouchies. Ow. Oh, the, the humanity. It hurts so bad. Okay, but now. Did I, like, punch it? Was I mad about that? Oh, it's happening. All the lights are off. And there are horrifying sounds. What is that? That was a long drop, but it hardly damaged me at all. Is this it? No. Um, so, all the power in here is off. I mean, I assume that just means that, like, the planet isn't blow upable anymore, or rather that the core the the gun no longer fires. Um, yeah, whatever. Okay. I have another. Oh right, the still suit. Don't need it. Um, okay, great. We're still. We should be in good shape. Let's um hop back down into here where it's very dark and spooky. Um, but we're gonna go outside very quickly because it takes us straight to the gate over here, which is where we wanna be. Look at all the enzymes that they're just plopping around all over the place. They're everywhere. I love it. All right, we're gonna go back in so we can get our Seamoth back uh, because we still have some things to do, everybody. Despite the fact that we have ended the quarantine, if a rescue ship were to come, it could come down, we could get on it, and we could leave. But, no rescue ship is coming, because no one... I mean, I think that people know we're out here, but it's gonna take forever for the, uh... <gasps> it's dead. Oh... Are you dead? No, you still have a light in your eyes. 
Yeah, and you're blinking. You're alive. You're just very tired. Your mouth is open. I could like, I could just like swim in there a little bit, have a look around for you. Um, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna get out of here. We're gonna get our seam off. We're gonna go back home, and we're gonna figure out what we need to do to build the rocket platform. And then we're gonna take that rocket platform out of here. We should have the parts and pieces for the first part of it, I think, already. Um, where am I right now? That's not where I wanted to be. Um, okay. Hiya, hiya. We we've done it. All right. Um, yeah, the first one was just like titanium and lead, I think. So that's easy enough. Um, but dude, we've done it. We've turned off the alien gun. We have ceased the quarantine. Now then. Um, I'm still going to leave you here in case we need more ion cubes. Which we may. For the, uh... For the... For the rocket platform, or the rocket, or whatever. Um... In fact, it might be worthwhile to just grab some ion cubes now, but we're all the way here. Let's just go. I think I have several ion cubes, so uh, hopefully it's enough. Oh, this is exciting, man. This is exciting. This game has been such a cool challenge. I really enjoy it. It's been just a great game. Um... So, we're back here. Dude, I am so ever glad that I had that beacon here <laughs> to put down as we were leaving hell. Like, thank goodness I carried that around for so long. Um, Because if I didn't have it, we would have had a heck of a time finding one of these places again. Uh, okay. I am looking for... There we go. We're going home, everybody. Because I think it's the vehicle... The mobile vehicle platform that allows us to build... The rocket... As well. So we need our vehicle platform to be there anyway. Um, so this is great. Super good. Look at this. Is it daylight out? No, it seems awful dark for it to be daylight. <laughs> <laughs> no, very dark. I can't believe that there's still fire over there after so much time. Uh, we've been on this isle or this planet for like weeks, right? Like that seems seems like those fires should have died by now. Oh well. Who am I to question the physics of planet K798 B why or whatever it's called with such a beautiful name such a beautiful name you know the indigenous culture here really nailed it on that one am i right or am i right okay we're home there's our base ah uh, what a trip it has been base i have so many things to tell you you're going to be so excited. Thank you. I'm glad to be back. Let's get our repairing on. Let's have a couple drinks. Slurp, slurp. And then have some noms. And then we're going to pop... We're probably going to sleep. We'll build the rocket platform in the morning. I think that's a great plan. Um, so let's have some quick dinner. Nom, nom, nom. Nom. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna do nothing. We're gonna put stuff in here. Boom. And then we're gonna do something in here. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we've got our locker full of salt. Our locker full of water. We have excess lantern fruit, so we'll just have a big fat dinner, which you shouldn't do right before you go to bed, by the way. But we're all right with it. 
All right. Good nap. Let's go build a rocket. Oof. Okay. Rocket building time. Now, here's the thing. Look at that. The salt's already done because we passed so much time. Wow. Didn't need any of those, I guess. Okay. All right. Good stuff. In that case, uh, we just got to swim out. Now, I could just grab a bunch of titanium and lead. Um, I'm, I am pretty sure that's all this thing needed, but... Sure. Six and ten, that sounds good. Um, and there's our platform. I want to climb. Thank you. Okay. Vehicles. Neptune escape rocket. Titanium ingot. A computer chip. Yikes. Okay. So two titanium ingots, a computer chip, and lead. Very doable. Uh, maybe not doable at this very moment, but easy enough. Do we have a computer chip? No, we squandered it on an advanced wiring kit. Um, but we can make our titanium ingots. We can't make any... Well, we can make one titanium ingot. All right, well, in that case, it is time to... Uh, what am I... Do I not... I have five... What am I doing? What am I even doing? There were five in here? Yes, there's the problem. Okay. Uh, I know I'm looking silly right now, but it's 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 all organized in my headpiece. Believe it. Um, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's put this titanium ingot back in here. And uh, we got a ton of rubies, ton of gold. We're probably going to need some copper. Yeah. And what did we need to make a computer chip? We need copper. Copper, gold, and table coral, right? Oh, he's learning. He's learning. I don't have any table coral in here. That's okay. All right. So first, let's grab our table coral. All right, there's the two pieces of table coral we need. Now, we just need um, titanium and copper. And the more copper we could find, the better, honestly. Um, because... We're probably going to need a lot of it. I'll bet we have to make many computer chips here. So, how did I never notice there were caves here? Like, right next to my... Right next to my face. We're also probably going to need some glass. Alright, titanium's good. So, picking up some quartz is probably a good idea. Um, and there's a ton of quartz here. So, that should be more than enough for our entire necessaries. I hate exploding fish. They're the worst. We got titanium here. More titanium. Um, I'm going to grab the cave sulfur. I don't particularly feel like we need it. Um, but that gives us like six total, I think. So... I don't know. It may or may not be worthwhile. Now, we may actually... Do, do we have five titanium? No, we just need two more titanium. And then we have everything we need. So, we'll get our titanium, we'll go back. Um, and build the first part, and we'll just quickly figure out what we need to make the second part. Alright. More copper. Good stuff. Okay. A lucrative trip into this big old thing. And we can go ahead and just, like, go through it to see if we missed anything. Look at this. Dude, we're probably going to find all kinds of copper here, which is great. 
I don't even care anymore, Curse Bloaty Fish. You guys are just jerks. I'm not even going to pay attention to you anymore. All right, I don't see any more titanium in here. Um, how many quartz do I have? I have an even... I have ten. That's, like, plenty. I think we're going to be perfectly happy with, with ten quartz. Ten extra quartz. This is the kind of thing that I'm looking for. Salvage. Inventory full. All right, here's what we do. We're going to put our sea glide in there. Um, we're going to put these med kits in there. And now we can pick up three full pieces of metal salvage. So let's see if we can find three full pieces of metal salvage, shall we? I have a feeling we're going to need just a huge amount of titanium to make this thing. So, um, that's fine. Picking up salvage is like consistently... <coughs> excuse me, uh, the fastest way to get, oh my god, bad driving, terrible driving, uh, what we want to do probably is find a kelp forest, you were too slow for me, buddy, you were too slow, <coughs> excuse me, um, yeah, we probably want to find a kelp forest, uh, because that's where stalkers are. And if, uh, if we go to where stalkers are, then they will be playing with their, their metal pieces and we'll be able to steal them. We'll be able to steal their joy. That's a mushroom. I was like, what the hell kind of egg is that? I've never seen something like that before in this game. Um, wah, spooky music. We would also accept more copper. But ideally, we will find, I don't see any stalkers, unfortunately. Um, yeah, we will, we would accept more copper. But really, titanium is what we're after. There's usually like little nooks. Um, that are just full of metal. I mean, where we find stalkers, we should find metal. Maybe they're just not out because it's daytime? There's more, they, they're more playful at night. You know what? Oh, look at this. We're gonna have to scan that, but um, it'll give us some titanium. Couple pieces. And that actually should be enough. But look at this. Oh, that's a brain coral. But look at this. We've already looked at this. Um, yeah, none of, I don't think, I don't think any of this counts as metal scrap. I guess there could be something in these boxes that we could scan. Nothing. Nothing. What a bummer, dude. All right, and what are you doing all the way up here? Go home, man. Go home. Okay. Well, we have enough stuff, so let's go make our thing, and then we're gonna need more parts. So hopefully, hopefully we don't have to find the blueprints for those. Um, Cause if we have to find the blueprints, we got a problem. We got a big problem. Uh, that would suck. Anyway, let's hope that it doesn't suck. And we just have to put our glass away. Uh, and our... Oh, we actually only had... I think we have more in another... 
Um, in another one of these. Is it in organics? No. Is it in lithium tit? No. Not in lead? Definitely not in the water. So maybe not. I actually am kind of glad I grabbed those then. Fabulous. Okay. Um, table coral. Copper wire. Can also make the titanium, of course. And copper wire. And then we just need our gold. Uh, we have exactly 10 titanium, so we need to get this. Where did we put the titanium ingot that we made? Uh, I swear I put it in this titanium locker. But I didn't. I put it in the treasure. Okay. And then we go here and we make ourselves another titanium ingot. We make ourselves a computer chip. And then we make... Well, we grab ourselves some lead. I don't remember how many it was. I think it was four... But I'm not positive, and I uh, I don't want to I don't want to have to go back in. All right, climb. Here we go. Four lead, perfect. Neptune launch platform. Hit me. I love it. Ooh, it's taken a long time to build. But that's okay. We're gonna watch. Seems like it's most of the way done. Oh. It's nice. Looks big. Looks real big. Sploosh! Wow, look at the effect that had on the water. I hope it didn't damage my, uh... <laughs> my base. Okay. Now, there's probably another thing on the platform itself. Now, can I deconstruct this if I wanted to? I don't think so. It looks like it's not really in the way, and it also looks like it's part of my base, so, like, I'm pretty pleased with the location here. All right, yeah, look at this. There's another jobber up here. All right, the Neptune Gantry. Plasteel ingot, copper wire, lubricant. That's very easy. Okay. Oh, it sure is fun to jump off of it too. Now, we're gonna need more titanium. Again, very doable. Uh, we're gonna need to make another copper wire. Copper wire, plasteel ingot, And what? What was it? <laughs> Shit. Um, copper wire, plasteel ingot, and something. Either way, we know that we need to go out and collect more. Um, are you done now? We know we need to go out and collect more titanium. Big time. So, let's definitely do that. Um, let's find that metal scrap cache. I know I know we'll be able to find it. Um, we can put our lead away and our copper wire. Lubricant. 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 So we need to... Uh, do we have lubricant, actually? We do. We've got two lubricants. So we don't need to worry about that. We just need titanium. So let's go out and get titanium, everybody. Oh, dude, we have titanium in here. And lithium, and an ion cube, and three pieces of keonite. How good is that? Oh, dude, we have enough. Can you believe it? Okay. We make the titanium. We st we're still going to need to go out and get titanium. Thank you, Shadow Dragon, by the way. Much appreciated. 
Um, we need lithium. Excellent. Then we need to grab our lube and our copper wire. Okay, copper wire, bam, and lube, bam. Was it really just one of each? I don't know how many if it wasn't, so let's check. I guess I could have just brought more, but whatever. Uh, okay. I should be swimming to the other ladder as well. Um, because it's closer to the platform, but no big deal. All right. We got it. Construct. <gasps> oh, yeah. Oh, big music sound. Look at the size of this thing. They made that out of one plasteel ingot. That's amazing. A plasteel ingot that I could carry in my swimsuit. Enough to make that. Constructing. Okay. Well, gonna take a little bit of time, folks. Um, we gotta wait until it's done before we can see what the next thing is, so... That's fine. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Done. Neptune boosters. A plasteel ingot, three nickel ore, two aerogel, and a wiring kit. You know what? I have the capability to write this down. I should. This can go. That can go. Okay. We might... Okay. Plas we, we're going to have to go get lithium, which sucks. Plasteel ingot... Three times nickel, two times aerogel, and wiring kit. So we have the wiring kit. The aerogel should be easy. Um, let's see. Obviously, we still need titanium. So let's go out on a titanium run. Because, um, again, we're just, we're going to need it. We're going to need it. So finding the uh, the titanium is a really good plan. Let's head out here into this here kelp forest and hope that we can find some scrap this time. Yeah, down here seems, yes, look at this. Scrap. We could also go into the um, more scrap. We could also go into the crash zone. Uh, which is a cool plan, if you ask me. Now, he's unhappy that we took his toy, I'm sure, but whatever. Um, we could also... We probably will need more copper wire. Oh, that's sandstone. Well, we may need more lead. We'll see about that. I doubt it, because we have a lot. Please, thank you. Um... More scrap, please. Okay, titanium is good. Oh, is that a scanabaru? No, it's just scrap. Fantastic. Got a little bit, got a little bit stuck there. That's okay. Good stuff. More copper. Okay. That's sandstone, but I mean, we might as well grab it. Like, we might need silver. Look at that. Oh, look at that, too. Incredible. All right, we've got room for three more. I wouldn't mind finding three more. Um, That would be pretty great, in fact. We've got plenty of rubber. Look at that. Uh, we got plenty of rubber as well, which is nice. Um, what is that? Oh, that's my rocket platform. I see. 
I see you, stalker. You've been playing with stuff? Because if so, I'm gonna steal it. If so, it belongs to me, rightfully. Really gonna attack my Seamoth there, guy? Hilarious. All right. Okay, that was nice. A nice trip there. Um, we could grab a few more things, but like, this is good. I think we can go back. Um, we'll keep an eye out on the seabed in the kelp forest here for more stuff, but... Look at that, he just conjured one. Thank you. Can I have a tooth, please? I'd really like a tooth. All right, oh well. I'm going back. That is not a creep vine, that is my sub. Can I get in, please? Thank you. <laughs> that was weird. Oh. Where'd it go? Bring it back. I want it. It's mine. It's mine. Can I, can I play? Oh, look at that, a tooth. Um, and we don't have enough, oh, we don't have enough room for it anyway. Okay, that's fine. Oh, but look, it's so worth it to drop these two and pick up that. Okay. Let's go. They're, again, very unhappy. And again, I can't freaking get into the Seamoth because the vines are in my way. All right. Back to base. Wherever that is. This way. All right. Thank you, stalkers, for being a never-ending source of all of the materials that I need. Um, okay. Really good. Super good. Let's go uh, turn all this scrap into titanium. And make another plasteel ingot. And then we need to make some aerogel. And then we need to check if we have any nickel. We're gonna have to go deep for that if we don't have it. Um, nickel. We have three pieces, thank God. All right, now we may end up needing more, which means we would have to go deep. But, whatever. We'll go back to the tree, maybe, in the Seamoth. Um, and that will, uh, that will have what we need there. I guess we could try to bring our sub back up, but what if we have to go back down? That would be awful. Alright, titanium ingot. Now, let's go grab a couple pieces of lithium and turn that into plasteel. And I think we actually have a little bit of aerogel too, do we? No. What was aerogel? It was rubies and purple jobbers. <laughs> Give me that wiring kit. Um, okay, put the copper away. Uh, put the lead away. Put the titanium away. We are two titanium short of 20, which means we're close to another ingot, another extra ingot. And let's put the stalker tooth in here too. Um, okay, plasteel ingot wiring kit, three nickel, two aerogel. So for the aerogel, we need rubies. Um, I'm gonna grab the nickel. And uh, we just need to go out to our garden here. I think we need four of these guys. Okay. Arrow gel. Oh, we just needed two. That's fine. We can put them back. Okay. Two aerogel, three nickel, 
plastiel ingot, wiring kit. That's everything. All right, let's do it. Oh, we're just flying through parts now, ladies and gentlemen. Just flying. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go around to this side. Because there's a ladder over here, and it puts us right where we need to be. All right. Going to start coming together now. Oh, jeez, it's huge. Those plasteel ingots really go a long way. <laughs> I can't believe this. I am shocked by the size of this thing. I guess to escape planetary gravity, you need a pretty damn big rocket, though. So, I'll take it. All right. Nearly done. Neptune fuel reserve. Plasteel ingot. ingot. Four crystalline sulfur, two... Ion power cells for Keonite. Okay, we're going to have to go back down, everybody. We're going to have to go back down. So, Plasteel, 4X, Crystal Sulf, 4X, Keonite, 2X, Ion power cell. I don't even think I know how to make ion power cells. Um. Hmm. Okay, all right. Well, <laughs> uh, we can get started on some of the stuff here. And then I think it might be back to the gate to hell. Uh, we're definitely gonna need more Keonite, so we have to go down there. I wouldn't mind harvesting a bunch of it anyway. Um, okay, but we can make the Plasteel Ingot. Okay. I think we need more crystalline sulfur too, which we actually got um, at the tree as well. So we could collect more nickel while we're there. But I feel like we can also get crystalline sulfur very deep. Now this ion power cell, might have to look that up. Might have to look it up. So we're going to do a venture into the deep next time on Subnautica. Thanks for tuning in. You know, I appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you later. I'll see you around. I'll see you next time. I can't wait to play more Subnautica. And I can't wait to do it with you. Have a great day. Bye.